Firefighting is a dangerous job, not just physically, but it can also take a mental toll even long after people are off the job. That's right, and there's a local group of former firefighters drawing strength from one another. And as KCAL's Jeff Nguyen shows us, they're doing it while also giving mm -hmm. back. But this museum coming here was a god shot for me. 61-year-old Ken Cochran volunteers at the LA County Fire Museum every Wednesday. <laughs> He helps around the workshop of restoring old fire engines, but he says the highlight is sitting down for lunch with the other volunteers. Lunchtime is like a brotherhood and we check in and we laugh. And that laughter is really good for mental health. Cochran had heart transplant surgery in 2022 after living with an artificial heart for nearly a year. A Department of Homeland Security report cited several organizations that estimate 100 firefighters take their own lives annually. Studies have found firefighters are more likely to die by suicide than in the line of duty. Joe Wojak started Workday Wednesday at the museum after his son Kevin died battling a wildfire in Arizona in 2013. When this building started, we started building uh, old fire engines. But we also started uh, building old firefighters, you know, rebuilding old firefighters. Some of the rebuilds end up in the museum's showroom in Bellflower. There are vintage equipment with hand-painted details honoring the history of the fire service. I think living in Los Angeles, probably not a day goes by that you don't hear a fire engine or a, or a rescue squad or something first responder related going around in your area. It's like one big family. Back at the workshop, Cochran says his second chance at life comes after a battle with alcoholism. I would come home after working and I would start drinking to kind of decompress. He's been sober for eight years. When he's not at the museum, he volunteers with Alcoholics Anonymous and a wellness program, helping firefighters with substance abuse and suicide prevention. Helping people is like, to me, it's like a natural high, actually. And helping people I get well by helping others. Getting well often starts with having the space to sound the alarm. In Bellflower, Jeff Nguyen, KCAL News.